we are exploring 10 mind molders so today we are going to see j for justice bible says god is righteous god is god of justice he is interested in justice he is involved in justice and he brings justice so as church we cannot ignore justice today when you look at justice many times we see the media reports talking about revenge talking about vengeance not about justice so the church has a role to teach about righteousness justice truth and righteousness justice are important aspects the values that has to be communicated to the world today so when you talk about the justice we have to remember david's prayer lord for your name's sake lead me in the paths of righteousness so not only believers walking in the paths of righteousness they should bring establish implement righteousness in the society so when we look at judiciary today when we look at society today there seems to be missing part that is justice so some cases in indian courts takes 20 years 25 years to be resolved so by that the delayed justice is denied justice so one person who brought to the notice of honorable judge so why injustice happens in the courts the judge said this is court of evidence it is not court of justice so if you want to change it into court of justice so you have to change the laws so if you don't change the laws you cannot bring justice so when we think about the denial of justice for many marginalized women and uh, low caste people and the not educ much educated people so that brings pain in our hearts the church has to encourage young people to become lawyers who will change the laws who will execute justice who will fight for the rights of the people who are deprived so who will be stand with the op- oppressed and fight against the oppressors who will be standing are giving solidarity to the exploited and fight against all the exploiters so that kind of justice hap- has to happen so justice is very important justice as mission is very important god is god of righteousness and justice and the church has to stand for justice if that has to happen so we have to encourage our young people to be involved in justice in righteousness and study law and implement law in the society may god bless you